Hey everybody, this is John, and with me again is Nick. Hello. Hi. For the most part, we've been playing some fairly... <clears throat> For the most part, we've been, we've been leaning more towards the, you know, the dark, violent side of things. You know, Dishonored, Kabuki Quantum Fighter, Pro Wrestling, things of that nature. But, you know, it's always, it comes always a time to, you know, mix things up, expand your horizons, you know, all, all that, all that stupid crap. So, we're going to try out a game. Now, I'm actually going into this blind. This will be a completely new experience for me. And Nick, you said you, were, you have not played this either, right? I have not. All right. I've heard it's pretty good, so... Hold on, hold on to your androgens as for Let's Play Long Live the Queen. Which is, uh... Androgen. <laughs> oh, yes. It's, um... This is actually originally, uh... This is Japanese, shockingly enough. Originally it was, um... I'm not sure who made it originally. It oh, okay, oh, no, no, I'm sorry. It was made by, uh, Hanako Games. Yeah. And then it was eventually, um... Released over here. And we're gonna delve into it. Ah. Got a quite, a quite nice rendition of God Save the Queen in the background. Now, just, despite the cute exterior, apparently this game is, like, really deadly. There are large That's what I've heard. There are large numbers of ways to die, and we'll probably encounter a lot of... In fact, actually, you over here, if you look at, like, you know, your stats, one of them is death. <laughs> Have you taken an arrow to the gut? Let your blood run dry. Choked on magical chains, drowned at sea, been blasted by magic, fallen victim to monsters, had your life drained, cracked your skull, blown yourself up, been poisoned, <laughs> gotten too close to a sword. Yeah, this is... Interesting. This ain't your little sister's anime princess game. <laughs> So, back to the title screen. Now, for preferences, there's not a whole lot of options. I mean, there's music and effects, sliders, tech speed, auto delay, controls. Um, wait, what I do? Oh, okay. Never mind. Um, video settings are a bit sparse, as you can see. Although it's not like you really need a huge number, for some reason the res the maximum resolution is one twenty is ten twenty four by six hundred. I don't know why. Hmm. Sort of an odd choice. This you is... can turn the debug on. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what you got. I I, I fiddled with that earlier. It's just uh, you know command line, and I don't know what you can do with that. There's probably some vast database of stuff for it somewhere online. Okay, but we're gonna okay we're gonna start the game. Are you ready? Hang on. Yeah, okay. I was trying to have a moment here. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. And start the game. Joslyn, King, Dowag King Dowager, Duke of Caloris. We're almost home. Your room is just the way you left it. Elodie, Crown Princess. Dot, dot, dot. I think her name is Elodie. Elodie? That would make more sense. Let's go with that. Jocelyn, King Dowager, Dowager, Duke of Caloris. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to read the title every time. <laughs> I know it's hard to leave your school and all your friends, but I've arranged the best possible tutors for every subject. You'll have to work hard this year to prepare yourself before your 15th birthday, but I know you can do it. You'll learn quickly, and you'll make a wonderful queen. It's what your mother would have wanted. Elodie, this is not what mother would have wanted. I'm not I'm not going to try to do different voices or anything. That's that that way lies disaster. <laughs> especially <clears throat> especially because any any female voice I try to d try to imitate just all it inevitably turns into Terry Jones playing an old the old woman in Life of Brian. So <laughs> If it isn't a personal question, how much more personal can you get? <laughs> You, you, you don't want to hear that for, you know, a whole Let's Play. 
I mean, my, my regular voice is don't. bad enough. Okay. This is not what Mother would have wanted. She wouldn't have wanted to die and leave me. No, she wouldn't. But sometimes bad things happen. We have to pick up and carry on. All of Nova depends on us. On you. Sigh. a pretty positive outlook for his wife having died. Well, you know, well now, now he's a bachelor, free-swinging bachelor king, you know? <laughs> I will be here to guide you until your coronation, but the decisions you make are ultimately up to you. Come, your maids are waiting. Welcome to Long Live the Queen. If this is your first time playing, you should read this brief introduction to how the game works. Tell me more. You'll be controlling Elodie, the almost queen of Nova, as she tries to prepare for her coronation. To do that, she needs to take classes every week in order to raise her skills. The skills she learns will provide different choices in the ongoing plot. Learning the right skills can mean the difference between life and death. You also need to keep an eye on Elodie's mood. With, with her mother's tragic death, Elodie is not very happy right now. Unlike her, <laughs> unlike her free-swinging bachelor dad. <laughs> the, the mood button will take you to the emotion screen for more details. That's mood. Okay, the, wow, so there's four different axes here. Angry, afraid, cheerful, depressed, willful, yielding, and pressured, lonely. Some of those combinations make more sense than others. Willful, yielding. Well, that, I mean, that makes sense, you know, you know how assertive you are or whatever. I'm not, I'm not sure why pressured and lonely are, like, opposite ends of a spec. Well, we'll see. Elo Elodie is feeling both afraid and depressed, but her strongest emotion is depressed. If she becomes more cheerful to cancel out the depression, her strongest emotion would then be afraid. Elodie's current mood affects her ability to learn. It will give her a bonus to some skills and a penalty to others. Let's take a look at the skills screen now. That is a lot of skills! Oh, wow. Skills are broken into four main categories. Social, physical, intellectual, and mystical. Inside these categories are skill sets, groups of three related skills. You start with zero in all skills. So I guess that school she used to be at that her father was talking about wasn't very good then. Every week, Elodie can study two skills. Normally she gains two points in a skill for every weekday that she studies. So if she studies history, she will, learn, she will earn two points times five days equals ten points. Because Elodie is depressed, she has a minus two penalty this, to, the so, to the social skill set, conversation. She doesn't feel like talking to people right now. Right now, If she studies conversation, she will earn two minus two points per day. That is, zero points. However, she has a plus bu one bonus to the expression skill set. If she studies one of the expression skills, she will earn two plus one points per day, which means three points per day, fi 15 points for the week. If you study a skill you have a penalty for, you could be wasting your time and not learning anything. If you study a skill you have bonuses for, you will learn much faster than normal. All these bonuses and penalties will change when Elodie's mood changes. She can also gain bonuses to skills by studying related skills. Check the skills screen every week to see your current bonuses. Once you know your mood, skills, bonuses, and penalties, you're ready to choose your classes for the week. The classes screen breaks down your skill sets by category for your morning and evening classes. When you select a skill set, three options in the set will appear on the right side of the screen. Choose a class option for both morning and evening classes, then click the Done button, which will appear in the lower right corner. As you play through the story, you'll sometimes, sometimes see feedback bubbles appearing over the text. These will tell you what's happening behind the scenes. Bubbles like these will show you when Elodie's mood is being altered by events. Bubbles like these will show you when the hit story is changing based on what skills Elodie has learned so far. If the test fails, there's some option being missed because she doesn't have enough points in that skill yet. This feedback is very helpful in figuring out different options to try. But if you don't want to see it, you can turn the bubbles off in the Preferences menu. Now, get ready to become a queen! I'm as ready as I'm gonna be, I think. Ready, Nick? I think so, yes. Too much math, but yeah. Is that some sort of sexist women aren't good at math joke? No, it's that I'm bad I at kid, math joke. I kid, I kid! I jest! Okay. Her skill. Anyway, look, like, look at that. Look, at, look at it. That's many. There's many a skill to be chosen from. Yes. Yeah. All right. Current well, mood. Not, Sorry. It's not a 
Princess Maker 2. I'm not familiar enough with the Princess Maker saga to comment, really. <laughs> Current mood. Bo okay, bonuses to expression and animal handling. Penalty to royal demeanor, conversation, athletics. Okay, now there's a lot of social, like the three, the, the, the big skills that are, which then have sub-skills, big skills are royal demeanor, conversation, expression, then in physical there's agility, weapons, athletics, animal handling, in intellectual there's history, intrigue, medicine, economics, military, then for mystical there's faith and the lumen, and then each of those has three sub-skills, which all have different bonuses or you know, detriments depending on your mood. Let's check our mood here. Yeah, we're very depressed. And I'm is time here. elapsing now? Is it? Oh like uh, no, no. It, it's like when you select. It's not like real time or anything. Okay. So when you like once you long. select, you select. You make your selections, and then time advances. Okay. I, I sort of like. I sort of like the idea that as you become less afraid, you just also become angrier. Oh like, man! Like you know, I like like it. like 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 now I'm kind of scared of heights, but then, but then as my as that as my fear diminishes, like right now I'd be kind of afraid to be on top of a wobbly ladder, you know, but as I improve that, I'll eventually I'll just be pissed off at the ladder. <laughs> Fucking ladder! Why am I up here? God! Goddamn skyscrapers! <laughs> okay, let's look at our classes. Oh, oh man. So, was her old school just super crappy? Why was all of her skills at zero? She, I, I, I don't know. Maybe it was public school. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. First thing we got to do as queen is boost funding for that, I guess. <laughs> all right, now we got bonuses to expression, so we might as well take it and animal handling. So we might as well try try taking advantages of those, right? Yeah. Maybe she just likes animals. Maybe. Let's see. Is there, like, a class that she could take that would make her less depressed? Well, I think there's, like, story events that affect that. We'll have to see. Mm -hmm. Expression. Decoration. Decoration. Drawing, painting, arranging flowers, dressing well. Instrument. Skill with musical <coughs> instruments, such as the harp and flute. Or voice. The skill of singing beautifully. That's interesting. You could just be a singer. Hmm. Let's see here. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with voice on the theory that if like there's a Zentradi invasion, we can use the power of song to make them stop. <laughs> and the other was uh, boost we have is uh, animal handling, right? Yeah. Let's see, animal handling. Our options are horses, horses, horses riding and grooming, dogs training and hunting, or falcons training and hunting. Interesting. Uh, puppies make people happy. Okay. Maybe uh, maybe the dogs will help her. Or. And, you know, if we could train them to, like, devour our enemies, that would certainly make me happy. Oh, yeah, definitely. All right. We're gonna... We're right, gonna violence we're... this game up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... It's gonna be a... Queen... Or so it's gonna be, you know... Queen Elodie, the singing... Pit bull, fighting pit bull trainer. <laughs> She'll be DMX. <laughs> <laughs> and here we go. <laughs> You practice deep breathing exercises to build up your ability to sustain a note. And then, oh, <laughs> afternoon. You visit the kennels and learn about different breeds of dogs. All right. Bonus. Depressed. Elodie, crown princess. What's all that noise outside? Who's here? Oh, it's my cousins and my aunt and uncle. Lucille, countess of Nix. Darling, we are so terrible, terribly sorry to hear about your mother, Fidelia. Thank you. Laurent, Duke of Merva. He's got... That's really bad facial hair. Oh, yeah. I mean, grow a beard or don't, dude. And these days, if you couldn't grow a beard, you were looked down on. Yeah. Like me. Yes, you you would not do well in the cutthroat court politics of the Kingdom of Nova, Nick. Yeah. You're... 
Your lack of a beard would give you a give you a minus one to all a number of different skills. <laughs> all right. You look what you look well, niece. Lawrence, Duke of Merva. You look well, niece. Charlotte, Lady Merva. Hi, Lodi. Hi, Lottie. Haven't seen you in ages. Will you be staying long? Yep. Mummy said we're here all month. Oh, plus one cheerful. Maybe, maybe we'll have some time to talk later. Now that you've finished studying, what will you do for the weekend? Okay, there's different places in the castle we can go with different possible effects. Like, here, Bad sneak. Here we can. Working for the weekend. All right, so here, like, we can sneak out, which gives us plus two willful, plus one lonely. We can walk in the gardens, plus one lonely, plus one cheerful. Play with toys gives plus one yielding, plus one lonely, plus one cheerful. Visit Charlotte, Lady Merva, question marks. Visit dungeons, no effect. Attend service, oh, minus one depressed. Visit two. Wait. Oh, that? minus one depressed. Oh, it takes away, it, it, it decreases depression by one, I think. Because then visit okay. tombs, plus one depressed. So, yeah. That's weird. Okay. Visit tomb, plus one depressed, plus one afraid. Explore castle, plus one lonely, plus one afraid. Attend court, plus two yielding, plus one depressed, plus pressured. Talk to your father, question marks. Don't grieve, kids. It'll just make you depressed. Let's and see. afraid, I guess. Well, it's, it's a tomb. It's probably spooky down there, especially if you're a kid. Well, she's not going to visit... I assume she's not just looking at graves. I would think she'd go to visit her mother, but I, we could be wrong. I don't. But it might be in some big, scary royal mausoleum or something. True. Big castles always have scary. Always have like. They always put those in the scariest parts of the castle. Let's talk to our father. Yeah. Dad, can we talk? I'm sorry. Your uncle and I have things to do. Maybe another time. My mom just died! Dude! <laughs> Maybe he's taking care of the funeral costs. I don't know. Oh. Plus one lonely. Nice. Poor Elodie. All right. Yeah, my parents are shitty after funerals. Now, week two. Let's check my mood now. Wait, that was what we did all week? Well, that in the classes. We had the classes during the week, and then the weekend we got rejected by our dad. Awesome. It's it's a lot like my childhood, actually. 